exclusive and welcome back to another episode of the draft to glory today with episode number three and um, first things first i want to say a massive thank you to everyone who's been watching this series of the draft um uh, you know it really means a lot to me that you you guys are seemingly really enjoying the series i'm really enjoying making it um i didn't think you know would be getting anywhere near the views we have been on on the videos it's um you know still somewhat small to i suppose other other bigger youtubers but for me it's it's incredible to see and uh, i can only thank you enough obviously all the new people joining us on the channel thank you very much for subscribing and becoming part of the exclusive family you are of course a bunch of exclusive legends so thank you thank you very much for that and of course if you aren't already subscribed please do consider subscribing becoming part of this uh, exclusive group that we've got here and uh, hopefully you enjoy the content we make as well so on with uh, on with the episode so of course uh, episode number three of the draft to glory we have the wheel glorious wheel spin behind us um if you are watching this of course do drop a comment of what you'd like to see maybe put on this wheel that isn't already on here if it is then of course it doesn't doesn't really matter um so if there's anything you can think of that you that you might like to see on the wheel good or bad do of course drop me a comment and uh, we can squeeze it in but for now got the got the same stuff i haven't added anything to the wheel just yet but i'm hoping we can not get what we got last time which was the uh, uh non-icon draft sorry and we got a league undraft so anything but that would be would be good to see so without further ado let's give this wheel a spin see what we are going to get today damn 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 i was really hoping it was going to be a uh, league undraft so i could re-spin it but We get Bundesliga draft, which isn't terrible. There is quite a few Bundesliga players in the game. Um, so, yeah, I guess that's not terrible, but I uh, just want to quickly check we are still recording. We are good to go. Okay. Yeah, there's quite a few um, Bundesliga players in, in the game. It just limits us a lot of what we can do. So, uh, I was really hoping we weren't going to get a theme draft again, but, you know, it could... Uh, it could be good for us at least we should guarantee us some sort of chemistry that's all i can uh, that's all i can say but uh starting things off we are going to take oh see do i take a four three one two put one two one two wide again i'm not really sure what's good in this game to be fair i do like a four three three so there is that but we're going to take I think there's more left mid and right mids in the Bundesliga. So we're going to take the 4-1-2-1-2 wide. Could come back to bite us with that one CDM. But we are going to start things off with no Bundesliga player. So we're going to take... I'm going to try and be a little bit smarter about it in this episode. Because uh, I've seen a lot of drafts on YouTube. And I thought, oh, you know, it looks really easy. Uh, anybody can do that. But actually, it's, it's considerably harder than it looks. So we're going to take Mertens. I think he's the obvious choice. It goes in a cam, which is a bit annoying. The first player we're going to get is Andre Silva. Nice. Okay. Brilliant. Great start. Um, second player is going to be Erling Haaland. Let's go. Big 86 rated Haaland. Incredible looking card. Uh, I've played against it a, a bit in Dear Rivals and it's completely destroyed me. That of course, you know, mainly because I'm I'm a bit shit, but um he is a very good very good player as well. Um left mid. We're gonna get ooh, wants to watch Sane, or we're gonna get DRB. I think it's gotta be Sane. I mean he's got basically the same pace, same dribbling ish. I mean physicals uh I mean are both very low, so it's pretty irrelevant. Passing's basically the same, and Sane's just got a bit of shooting with 81. Let's have a quick look. Yeah, 76 finishing. It's gotta be Big boy, Leroy, Jenk, no, Leroy Sane. So, right mid. I don't get anybody. We're going to, mm, any Portuguese? No, we're just going to take Walcott then, I guess. Doesn't make much difference. CDM. We haven't seen an icon. We haven't seen an icon at all yet. I mean, I've seen one in the last draft that was uh, Shevchenko. Of course, we've got to take uh, Delaney. With the Bundesliga links, right back, Pavard. 
Not a whole lot of choices, kind of just picking itself at this point with the uh, whole Bundesliga theme. Holstenberg. Holstenberg, Holstenberg, Holstenberg. Not quite the player you want to see. He's not brilliant. So I'm hoping he might uh, not stay in the draft, but we do get uh, Upamecano. Get a lot of nice players. But of course, Upamecano has to be the one. Other centre back. Ooh, okay, so no Bundesliga player, but I think the smart choice would be Rudiger, maybe? Who else have we got? We've got, oh, Upamecano. So actually, probably not. Longley probably is the good shout. So French keeper or Bundesliga would help us get Berkey, Glashy, Leno, Handanovic. Now, Berkey, he's got a bit of diving, worse handling, worse kicking, worse positioning, better speed, better reflexes. But I think Glashy is just slightly better all round. Six foot three, so we'll go with him. Gulashi gets a strong link to Upamakano as well. Um, start with the subs this time. We started with the bench last time, so we'll start with the subs. Get Sommer. Um, let's get. Uh, I'm not even gonna try. I don't know. I'm gonna take Sommer, highest rated and Bundesliga. Fernandinho, Hernandez, Quadrado, Kolarov. No Bundesliga. So, uh. Let's have a quick look. What's um we'll take Hernandez. Better option. And he does link, I mean not that we can really put him in, but he does link to a few players. Second centre back. Wow, we don't actually get anybody we can really use. We'll take Carl Walker. Bit of a beast. All we need is a right mid, really, and a cam. There's our cam. So Brandt will go straight in the squad. Bringing up the chemistry by a massive amount, to be fair. Conte, Marco, Royce, Bruno, big pulls, but um, yeah, I mean, we can only really use Marco Royce. Is he better than Brandt? He is better than Brandt in shooting, so we'll put him in over there. Uh, Brandt obviously being a little bit quicker. That would give us a bit more chemistry, I suppose. It's on three. Not ideal, not ideal. I'm hoping we can either get a French French player or a Bundesliga right mid or right wing. Uh, Di Maria, I suppose, would be a good option, but it's not it's not really what we're looking for. Um, I guess we'll take Rodrigo. All right, so reserves. We really need a right mid player, please. This is where the draft will screw you, so... Uh, We'll take Alex Texera. Mobley Muller. Again, not really what I'm looking for. I guess we'll have to take Muller, but uh, he's not going to make it into the squad. We do need a new striker, really, as well, to be fair, but uh, we're not not getting it. We'll take Z... 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 Zefuk, Zef, Zefuk. He might do quite well up at right mid though. He does get six chemistry. Uh, at the moment, that's kind of our only options. So, uh, brilliant. Really is brilliant. Uh, we'll take Muller over Rodrigo and we'll put him on for Sommer, I guess, for now. We have got the highest rated squad we've built so far this year. Mobilier. Guerrero, who is not uh, not the best option in the world, but he is a bit of a left mid, right mid. So it's just, would he be better than... Well, I suppose he would be. He's got better shooting, and that's kind of what we need. His pace is god-awful. I thought he used to be, like, rapid, but apparently not. He's got okay shooting. Okay, well, actually, pretty good passing. Great dribbling. Um, strength is pretty poor, but stamina's all right, I guess. And defending's not terrible, so... He, uh, he actually might do quite well there, but striker or centre-back, come on, for the Bundesliga. Hmm. We actually have some options, to be fair. Zachariah would be probably a little bit better than considering... We, uh, we could play him at centre-back as well, though. Or we could take Thurman. 
for the striker option. Or of course we could take the very obvious uh, Alara, Alario. No idea for uh, the quite clearly striker role, uh, but he is dreadfully slow. And I don't really want to do that myself. I could... He'd probably get enough chemistry at striker to be all right. But Zachariah, especially in defence, would that be better than having Longley? I don't actually think so. Would it be better than having Delaney? I don't think so. I think it's better that we take... I'm going to take Thurman. That might have been the bad or worst choice. And I apologise for that. But I feel like having him there, even on three chemistry... That's pretty shit, isn't it, actually, as well? Okay. Well, I mean, you'll be on four chemistry if we can get a French or Bundesliga manager. So, not all hope is lost. Um, we've got Longley on seven, which isn't bad. That's fine. Everybody else is on okay chemistry. Well, perfect, apart from uh, Guerrero, who's on six, which is enough. You know, six is enough. I just says he's on five, but he's on six. Player chemistry five, that doesn't make much sense. He is on six chemistry. Anyway, let's choose our manager. Hopefully we'll get a French manager or a Bundesliga. We get none of those. We get, wow, Danish, 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 Norwegian. And then we get uh, our, uh, Portuguese. Brilliant. Fantastic. Superliga, 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 Super... Is, uh, that's what it says. I don't know. But they're all from the same league. Dutch, not Dutch. Denmark or Norwegian. Oh my god, okay. Um, well, that hasn't really gone to plan, has it? So, can either... I mean, we haven't got much choice, have we? So we'll just take that. Okay. So that's how the team is going to look. We currently have a 181, but we could obviously have a uh, 184. Um, I just wonder if... Moving any of these players around like that would give us... More chemistry. It's Sane up top then. Minus twos all round. But then uh, if we put Thurman. Yeah, it's minus twos. So that's not terrible. It was minus seven. So uh, I think the game kind of had a bit, uh, bit of a shit the bed moment. Um, he's okay, I guess. It's just, it's just not brilliant really, is it? It's just not brilliant. But we have to use Bundesliga players. I just wonder, actually... Hmm. See, I mean, that would be better. That would be better. I mean, he's obviously a little bit worse than Longley, but um, I think having Hernandez there is probably going to be a lot more beneficial. It's just, do I use somebody who's a little bit quicker over, over Pavard? He has only got 69 pace, but he does have a... Uh, or is it Catalyst? It does have a Catalyst on him. Or, yeah, Catalyst. Sorry, I, could, I didn't even read that. Um, so he has got supposedly a 79 pace. Great passing. So I think I'll leave it with him. Um, we'll see how he does. I've got a few options for right back in the way of like Carl Walker. So we could just sub him out immediately. Excuse me. And then put Carl Walker in there. Uh, which isn't a bad shout to be fair. And maybe same with Guerrero. Just sub him out and put Di Maria in there. Um, and then of course we've got Mertens for the strike option. Which I think... I don't think Sane is going to be too bad to be honest. Might have to try him out and see how he does. But I think actually for today. That's not a bad team. You know for once we've actually built a fairly nice draft. Um, you know. Good hybrid. Good links. We we were shackled to a, to a Bundesliga team. So you know I suppose it was a little bit easier. But... Overall, the picks we actually got were really nice. You know, they actually uh, helped us a lot instead of uh, forcibly trying to screw us over, um, which is never ideal. But yeah, anyway, that's how the team's going to look. Um, I suppose without further ado, we'll jump into the first game today and we'll just pray we don't lose in the first round. <laughs> yes, it's time to stop. No, this is... This is not okay! Alright, well, one thing we've established is that uh, 
Yeah, as it turns out, I'm uh, I'm terrible at the draft. Yeah, but with that said, we are going to jump into the draft again, throw 30,000 coins down from the drain and see if we can uh, just pick up a win. I don't know. That's all I want, really. Just not come up against somebody who's, like, just pro level. Uh, I don't know. Anyway, it is what it is. So uh, let's take... Four, three, two, one. Why not? How how bad can it be? We're going to kind of jump through this draft so we get. Uh, unfortunately, we have to take Jaden Sancho. Does going up right back, right forward. It's going to give us Mares. No Bundesliga players, but we're going to take. Uh, we'll take Mares. I can't imagine he'll be in the team. Hopefully, on at the end. Again, no. Uh, no Bundesliga players, so we'll take just the fastest player, just in case. Icon, maybe? Please? Nope. We have to take full crook. Full crook? Brilliant. I can see where this draft is going already. Down the drain. Uh, so we get Campbell, we'll get Arnold. We'll take Arnold, I guess. He gets the German link, which could be quite good for us. Marcus Lorente, Valverde. It's no Bundesliga, is it? No, we'll take Marcus Lorente. Uh, so far, absolutely no links whatsoever. Um, and the same theme continues. So Pjanic, Rakitic, uh, we'll take, or Saul possibly. Um, I guess it doesn't really matter. They're all about the same shit level. So we'll take Saul. I guess a perfect link to Marcus Lorente. Uh, Holstenberg, anybody? We do get An Angelino is a little bit better than uh, Holstenberg. No Bundesliga, but we could take Jimenez. He has got quite a good link to Saul, goalkeeper. Icon? No. Uh, we get Nubal. Nice. Nice. This draft is looking to be uh, somewhat awful. Um, we get Ginter, who we're going to have to switch over there. It's not bad, to be fair. It's not terrible. It's not terrible at all. We get Guaita. Guaita. Uh, surprisingly, actually, no Bundesliga. So, we can take... we we'll take Benitez, I guess. He's highest rated. He looks the best. Um, Centre-back number one. We're going to get Alfonso Davies. There we go. That's more like it. So we can either stick him at left back or put him at hmm, we'll put him at left back because I think uh, right back we could probably do with a La Liga um, defender and we do kind of get that we don't get any Bundesliga so we'll take Mendy who's going to go in there over Sancho Sancho then can go in over Mares um, that's not looking too bad to be fair that's, that's that's pretty good that's pretty good I'll take that so far get Sane. Uh, nobody else will take Sane. Goes in there, gets us even more chemistry. Getting all those strong link. Let's go. Um, doesn't inherently work at left forward, but he is on six chemistry. So it is what it is. And we get rule breaker Marco Royce. Ooh, okay. Who, uh, could I? How much chemistry? We get three chemistry. We'll put him there for now because he is somewhat better than full crook. Full crook. I don't know. Um, we get Messi, Bale, Zaha. Wow. Okay. Um, I was destroyed with. I was destroyed by Messi in the last game, so we'll take him. Um, second substitute for the last one. It's going to be Mukiel. Mukiel, who we're going to have to take. Reserves number one is going to give us. Nobody, so we'll take uh, highest rated. Second one is going to give us nobody. Brilliant. Wow, this is a, you love to see it. You really do. Get Kamara. Swallow. Left mid from uh, Wolfsburg, but it's no help whatsoever. Laporte. We do get Carver Howe, to be fair. That's not a bad shout. We'll take Carver Howe. There wasn't any Bundesliga, was there? Pretty sure there wasn't. Doesn't doesn't matter at this point. To Stegen, get Mbappe. Ooh, okay. 
take Mbappe, you'll be an incredible super sub. So that is how the team is going to look. Um, put all these kind of players on the bench. So do to do Angelino can go off for Fulkrug. Uh, and we kill for Burgess. I don't know. Anyway, that's how the team's looking. Um, we have the choice of either six chem Mendy or a I think full chem Carver Howe. And I think even though on six chemistry, I think he's probably better. But defending, obviously, better. Many's he's got better physicals. Better passing, slightly on Carver Howe. Dribbling slightly better, but pace is considerably worse. So, um... Chem over the player. I'm going to put Mendy in. I think he'll be... I don't know. Maybe that's the worst choice again, but... We'll put him in. Um, I'm just trying to see if there's anything else we can do. If we can get a German manager, we can, or we could either just start with full Krug up at, up up top, and then just sub Marco Royce in or sub uh, Mbappe in or something like that. Probably would be a better shout. In fairness, um, we didn't get anybody else, did we? Mukiel is not going to help us at all. I mean. Ironically, that's actually not a bad team. That's really not a bad team. Uh, it's just hoping we don't come up against some world beater and get thrashed 10 0 again. Um, but yeah, for now, that's how the team's going to look. We're going to get our manager, see what we get. German, anything but Danish or Norwegian would be great. Uh, do get a German manager. It's not Bundesliga, but um, he would help quite a few people on chemistry. So get Sani onto seven. Uh, da, 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 six or oh, ten, ten. Not bad, not bad at all. Um, or do we take La Liga for our centre mids? Get them on eight. I think we've got to take the uh, German manager, even though he doesn't help. Um, our four chem Sancho, which isn't isn't brilliant. We'll take him, and that should help us considerably. So, um, yeah, one seven five. Obviously, not too worried about chemistry, but we have got a very good team. In fairness, a very good midfield, um, you know, a good attacking line, strike obviously to be desired. Goalkeeper is not ideal. Um, we do have Schwallow though, is he better? Diving, no, nope. handling, no, nope. kicking the same, reflexes slightly better, speed slightly better, positioning worse. Oh no, on, on Nubal, sorry, I was looking at the wrong one. Um, yes, yeah, so we'll put Schwallow in, he looks like the better keeper. Um, and that's pretty much it. That's how the team's going to rock up for the second try at the draft. If we get knocked out in the first round again, we'll just take it and we'll see what we get in the packs. But uh, yeah, jump into the first game, see how things go. All right, here we go for the second try at the draft. He's got a um, somewhat average team. Obviously, Mo Salah up at Cam, going to be wildly off chemistry. Ben Yedda, Joel Linton, I think that is. Mane, he's got Gerard, Steven Gerard. Um, good looking team, to be fair still have yet to see any real icons besides um, Shevchenko. I do want to pause it and uh, quickly take off full crew. So we're going to immediately sub him off for um, Mbappe. Uh, da -da -da -da. Do I bring on Marco Royce as well? I'm just trying to think who might be slightly better. I'm going to, I'm going to play, with, play with the team mostly as it is for now, just to see how it plays. And uh, if Sancho's not good enough, which he Arguably doesn't look like it. We'll take him off for Messi. We'll go with that. But overall, the team's actually pretty good. Defense is solid. Midfield is solid, and then attack is obviously good. Now with full Krug off the uh, off the pitch. Um, but yeah, we've actually got a fairly fairly half decent team. Go on, full Krug. Before you get subbed off. Yes, lad. Let's go. Yo, let's go. Full Krug getting the first goal before you get subbed off. Yes, lad. That's what we're talking about. He gets uh, taken off immediately. He knew that was coming, so he's like, I have to get a goal. He knew Mbappe was coming on to take his place. And then, uh, let's go, 1-0. Oh, no. Ben Yedda, oh, he's missed. Let's go. He took an early shot. Kind of uh, baited him out with the goalkeeper rush, but uh, very lucky, to be fair. Very lucky. That seems a little bit all over the place right now, but we've got Sancho making a run. Couldn't quite do anything with it. Is he onside? 
Is he on side? He is on side. Wow. Okay. Literally no idea. I just took the shot because I thought, um, why not? But that's what you got to do. Always play to the whistle. Sancho makes it two. Oh, Sancho, come on. Make it three. He does make it three. Let's go. What a tight angle to score it. 3-0 for Sancho. That's a little bit lucky. Uh, I've seen absolutely nothing from Mbappe, really, besides that pass. He's uh, yeah, been kind of silenced by this guy's defence. Just seen, actually, ironically, Sancho did have a uh, hunter card on him. So, you know, if I had taken him off, it probably would have been a bit of a waste, actually, considering. Come on, pass it across. Sane, let's go. What a good goal. Just watching where his defenders were going and then just makes the run. Jeez. 4-1. Okay. We did sadly concede a goal, which I'm a bit, a bit irked about because we were defending really well. No way. Oh my god, he's got another goal back. I literally can't believe this. This is mental. Just nobody's making any passes. This is crazy. Alright, let's take off Arnold for Royce. Messi's going to come on for Sancho. And that's that. Yo, Messi, go on. Couldn't quite get it to Sane, but... There we are. We held on. We held on. I genuinely should have been 6 or 7. Easily should have been 6 or 7, but we uh, finished at 4-3. Uh, this guy did pull back you know, three goals, so we made it a little bit tense near the end, but, uh, you know, closing up to like that, wasn't it? So, um, yeah, it was, uh, it was pretty tight, but yeah, in insanity, how the game kind of just flipped on its head near the end. This guy obviously went more attacking and then, um, yeah, we just could like passes just went everywhere. We couldn't really break on through and Bappe just didn't want to score. Crazy, crazy game, but we played really well to be fair to get the victory. So we're moving on to the second round. Uh, second opponent today is either uh, second or third round. I actually don't know at this point if we've moved on, if we haven't. I think it's still the second round because that game would have probably counted as nothing, seeing the guy quit at the beginning. But yeah, good team. Icon right mid. Not the greatest um, team in the world. Kick it. See the run? Definitely not going to be quick enough, but... We'll take it for now. Still got it. Go on. Full crew. Get a good ball in. Oh, wait. Wait, it's falling luckily. And we get the first goal. Yes, there we go. Sancho sticking a foot out and just winning the ball back. Let's go. Full crew. You know, I've, I kind of forgot to take him off, but he's staying on the pitch for now. So uh, we'll take him off at a hard time. But cheese puts in a great ball. Gets our first goal. Sets the deadlock apart. So, ooh, okay. Dangerous. 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 Good job. Good job, team. Hmm, I dived in there, but... Oh, damn. Couldn't stop it. It was coming for a long time, to be fair. Just, uh, you could feel just when the passes weren't weren't connecting that uh, something was going to go against us. Uh, okay. Come on, Sane. Yes, there we go. Sane. Let's go. Big ups. We're not out of the game yet. Not the game. He can go attacking. We can go attacking too. That's all we need. Jeez, it's a tough game though, to be fair. It's very end-to-end. -end. Uh, I mean, he's defending really well. We're defending really well as well. Um, there's not much in it besides just the odd whoever makes the mistake first, really, kind of game. Who's willing to commit a little bit more to uh, possibly get the, the winner? That could be it. Damn, Salah is just too quick for me. I just couldn't keep up with him. That's it. Damn. I can't believe that. That's crazy. Another second round exit. It's so sad. We did really well in that game. I think a lot of improvements, but like we just couldn't we just couldn't hold it off. Just couldn't hold off Salah and all that kind of stuff. Uh defending just wasn't good enough. I did do my best. I'm really trying. Really, really tried. Just couldn't couldn't make it happen. But, you know, it is what it is. I'm quite impressed that we brought it back from, uh, you know, we're up 1-0. He brought it to 1-1. He went to 2-1. Then we went to 2-2. And then just 3-2. And that's how it ended. But, yeah. 
that's the way it goes sometimes. It's the way it goes. Doesn't matter. Um, I do know there's some there's some Champions League or Europa League cards you can get from silver packs. So yeah, there's always a chance we could get something uh, somewhat worthwhile. I doubt he's going to make our money back. He's not. Probably about 900 coins. Uh, keep those and we'll check those a bit later on. That's fine. Premium silver's pack. I'm just disappointed, man. Just disappointed we couldn't uh, we couldn't at least hold a draw against that guy. Sad. Got a few Premier League silvers there, which is quite nice. But gold packs. If we can get something half decent, even like a uh, like an inform, even a low rated one would be uh, good to make our money back. Not out of this one. Okay, so we get uh, Vigel. Uh, nobody there really. I think of any any proper worth. There we do get turn and zoom. Yeah, well, that probably is a 5k celebration, I think, actually. So I'm going to stick it up for 5k. Turn and zoom, let's go. That's probably the best thing we could uh, could actually have got out of that pack. Um, might sell for a few coins. We'll stick that up as well. Um, gold pack number two. Let's go. Come on. Big boy Messi in form. What are my chances? Probably quite low. It's a rare. That's all it is, though. Okay. Goes for about 3,000 coins. That's not terrible. So I'm going to stick that up for what are we three two point six. So I'm going to say two point eight should be fine. Two point eight thousand coins. So uh, with that celebration, turn and zoom. Hopefully selling for five k at some point. I'm not sure if it is. I'll have to I'll have to check on that. But it's I think it's pretty expensive anyway. Um, so we've made about seven thousand coins so far just out of two items. The rest I can sell at a later time. Okay, Muso, he's a goalkeeper. He's not gonna sell for much, is he? As per Endo, Nacho, right mid to right wing. Could get a few hundred coins out of that one. Um, wing to right, right back. I can't imagine that'll sell for anything. All right, last pack today, last one. Premium gold pack. It's been pretty awful again, and this one's been awful as well. That's that. That is that. So it is what it is. Again, I can only apologize. I am trying my best in draft. Uh, I've never actually played draft before properly, so this is really my first time um, really giving it a go. Um, I don't know. I'm just struggling. Just struggling to get the grips of this game, really. They keep patching it and changing things, so it's just... I don't know. It's just so hard to kind of learn, really, what's going on. Because at the start of the game, you know, pace was so prominent. Now it seems like they've kind of cut pace out a little bit in a lot of players. They don't seem quite as quick. Um, that could just be me. That could be like a placebo, but um, that's just how it feels, really, to be honest. So it's just difficult. It's just difficult. But either way, hopefully you do enjoy... The draft series so far even if i am a little bit shit uh hopefully you are still finding some enjoyment out of them um and if you are please do drop it a like that'll be very very much appreciated of course that will help the channel out massively um and if you want to see more of this or any more of the content we produce on this channel please do hit that subscribe button as well become part of the exclusive family um and yeah with that said um thank you very much for watching i do hope you enjoyed and we'll see you next time.